An apartment complex has 22 units. 12 units rent for $1,100 a month and 10 rent for $1,400. Vacancy and collection losses in the previous year were 6% of gross potential income. Annual operating expenses are estimated to be $72,000. If the capitalization rate of similar properties is 9.5%, what would be an appraiser's estimate of value? So to start this problem, let's look at the total number of units we have. 22 total units, and we know that 12 are going to rent at $1,100 a month, and that means they'll bring in $13,200 monthly. Now when we're doing these problems, we're going to need annual figures. So we'll multiply that by 12 for each, month, each of the months in the year, and that gives us a total of $158,400. The other units, 10 of them, rent at $1,400 a month. So that means monthly, they would bring in $14,000. And we know, again, we need a annual amount, so that's gonna give us $168,000. When you add both of those numbers together, you get an annual amount of $326,400, and that is our potential gross income. This would be what would come in if every single unit was rented every single day of the year and nobody was late, nobody was evicted, anything like that. So now that we have the potential gross income, we've got to take out the vacancy and collection losses. That potential gross income of $326,400, we're not going to see 6% of this. Now personally, I would just put this in the calculator as $326,400 times 94%. We know we're not getting 100% of that $326,400. We're only getting 94%. And that math tells us that we would be receiving $306,816. This is our effective gross income. So this $306,816, that is before expenses, and we need to take those out. So the 306,816, subtract our operating expenses of $72,000 annually, that's going to give us $234,816. This is our net operating income otherwise known as our NOI. So when finding value, we're going to use the equation value is equal to NOI divided by cap rate. And I know a lot of you use T-bar, so let me T-bar that. You've got your cap rate at the bottom, you have your NOI at the top, and that's gonna give you value. So filling that in, our cap rate is 9.5%. Our NOI was 234,816. We have a top and a bottom number, so we're going to divide. So our value for this property, doing the math, is going to be 2,471,747 dollars. Again, that's 2,471,000. $747. Well, I hope this helps, and as always, just let me know if you have any questions or if you need another problem done.